Okay, let's stop with this guy. Oh, Joe Kun, I'm going to club right now. What are you going to do? Okay, spend time and photograph. Oh, then let's go together. Guess who gets him happy? Get to the high school science room. The inside of the dark room smelled like developing institution. The hours will by while you were having fun. Everyone, can I have your attention please? Can I have your attention please? It seemed that the photographer case we can the contest really coughed the eyes of the judge. They said you'll definitely be receiving a prize, Kesuke. Huh? I don't understand. What does that mean? It means you place in the top four. At best, you'll receive first place, and at worst, you receive an honor honorable mention. The judges were very impressive with your awareness and control of the depth of field. Congratulations, Kesuke. Hey, good job, Kesuke Senpai. Everyone is admiring Kesuke. Dad, that means you should tell your dad. Fifteen? No, you don't have to quit. Zero. You should tell your dad. That's right. My dad promised me. He said if I won, I could do whatever I want. So this man, I don't have to listen to him anymore, right? Kesuke seems very happy. Hey, we should celebrate. Yeah, that would be fun. Thanks, everybody. And sorry for causing you so much trouble, Chao-kun. Well, we should probably get going. You're coming to the party, right? Kesuke has expressed his gratitude to you. Your relationship is stronger now. Mrs. Voice ring in your head. Your arm, I am you. Did I say the opening? Hello guys, this is Chao Chao 2025. In Persona 3 FES Journey. I am mean to drop your party, Kesuke, but there are a few things I need to talk to you about. But don't worry everyone, it won't take long. Please wait outside the faculty office. We decide to go to the faculty office. <clears throat> Kikukan High School outside the faculty office. Well, Kesuke, the judge think you have a lot of potential. So if you are interested in studying abroad, they'll be willing to help you transfer to school overseas. Me? Study abroad? Oh, Kesuke, there you are. I was looking all over for you. Come quick, Mikarin just fainted. Huh? Oh, okay, I'll be right there. Sorry, Sensei. This is all so sudden. I need some time to think about it. Playing doctor again. He say he doesn't want to be a doctor, but he's always trying to help people in need. A doctor's son with just with such talent. I have to say I'm a bit jealous. It doesn't seem like anyone's in the mood to celebrate now. Well, I guess I'll let everyone know what happened. You can get going if you want. I'm saying goodbye to everyone. He decided to go back to the dorm. Yeah, he said he doesn't want to be a doctor, but he acts like a doctor. Talk like a doctor. Sup, dude? Tomorrow is full moon, but we don't have any shadow to kill. Man, this sucks. I heard Yuji not feeling good. Maybe he's been studying too much. <laughs> Nah, that can be it. Even though I guess is only a robot, her words really touch me. How can I help you? I guess has been acting different lately. She seems to have something on her mind. What do you think, Chao Kun? I can tell. Are you saying it's just my imagination? Just my imagination? Well, I hope you're right. <coughs> Suddenly something has happened to me. I agree. I wonder what happened to her. I guess they don't like Ryuji Kun from the moment she met him. Do you think it's because they just don't get along? 
I uh, don't really care. Yeah, you're right. It's none of my business. Yeah, it's probably because he's always flirting. To be honest, I don't really like him that much either. You don't like everybody, Yukari, but yourself. Even you don't like your mom. There's nothing interesting on the news. Yeah, it's very lazy. Everyone's studying for the exam, but make sure you don't tire yourself out. Ryoji asked Mitsuru out? <laughs> I'm surprised he's still alive. That guy's got a lot of guts. Hey, I want to talk to Junpei. Dude, I was surprised I each other said that. Do you think I influenced her somehow? I guess. Where are you, I guess? Is this not around? Oh, is this here? What do you think you're doing here, I guess, alone? Um... I will make sure you're safe, so please do your best on your exam. Damn it, I guess. What are you doing to your own, what you are done to Ryoji? Are you that crazy? Answer me, I guess. Damn it. Tomorrow is the full moon. Can't panic. Yes. Right now, the Mavogra are more like her. Over me. Sigma Drive, Mega Protein. Sleep. It's full moon, man. It's freaking full moon. <coughs> Good morning. I intend to do my best to protect everyone. Okay. Is something wrong? No, please, do not worry. I just want to share my feelings. I'm counting on you. I understood. I just gone berserk, man. Hey, are you coming to student council today? I'm not sure. I see, I want to talk to you about something. I appreciate if you came. Well, excuse me. Let's see if it tells you something important to discuss with you. Maybe you should go to the student council room after school. Student council room after school. No, I'm not gonna talk to you. Oh, well, coincidence. Are you coming to the club today? I haven't decided yet. That's right, you're free to make your own decision. <coughs> what the hell is you calling, man? Oh, that's her. Class has ended for today. Okay, it's Yukari time. I think we ended the story of Yukari right here, right now. Accept the offer. Great, let's go somewhere. Yukari seems excited. Damn it, it's not the end yet. Damn it, Yukari. Your day. Tonight is the full moon, but we won't be conducting an operation. Maybe I should summon Juno though, just in case. By the way, have you seen Aegis? Isn't she in her room? Okay. Aegis has been returning late these days. She never used to. I wonder what happened. No, I haven't. Aegis has been returning late. Yeah, yeah. Doesn't matter what I answer. Even though I guess only yeah. I guess in like yeah. 
Man, they're so lazy, man. I hate this. There's nothing interesting on the news. Damn it, even the news? Everyone's starting for the. Yeah. Please say a different word. Damn it. I mean, what usually happens with Persona Game is every, after every single day, it's different dialogue, and suddenly the dialogue changes to just that. It seems like they really are lazy. Like in the second Persona, every after mission, they talk different thing than. After a few while, they say the same thing over and over again. What will you do? Sleep. Nothing I could do, alright? It's full one. <coughs> I've been looking for you. Damn it. You. You're... What are you doing here? Oh, that's right. You don't really like me, do you? Damn it, I think I just do something to Ryoji. Says not. So what the hell are Ryoji doing all this while? Well, to answer your question, I ended up here when I came to my senses. It's strange. The sky and the ground look so weird. And there's no one here. Something terrible has happened here. And yet I feel at peace. Have you forgotten? Forgotten what? The dark hour. A time period few people are active during. But you... You've somehow adapted to it. Too well for a human, in fact. Yes, it's all so clear. Now, I understand the reason behind this feeling I sense when you're around. You are not good. You are... my enemy. Your enemy? That's right. On a night like tonight, the moon was full. It was long ago. Yes, we met once before. As adversaries. Who, who am I? Are you? I am Igis, the last remaining anti-shadow emergency control weapon. A machine created to destroy shadows. Created to destroy shadows? And you, your true name is Death. Oh, the mysterious boy. You Harris. are the shadow I sealed away ten years ago. <coughs> it's Barrow's man. Yes, ten years ago. The night I was born into this world, I set foot on this very bridge. The sole purpose of my existence is to destroy shadows. For that reason, I was given a personality and a persona. They said I was death. The 13th Arcana that was never meant to be. And I wasn't in this world for long before parts of my body escaped me, leaving me incomplete, as I was when I met you. 
Even so, your strength was far greater than I anticipated. The only possible alternative was to seal you away. And as circumstance would have it, a suitable vessel was available. A human child standing nearby. So I did what was necessary. I see. So I was confined within him. And I led him to my twelve missing pieces without realizing it. And then... I remember! I remember everything! It all makes sense now. Who and what I am. Palladian! Stop, don't be foolish, I guess. There's no way you can win. I'm different than before. A machine is created for a purpose. Mine is to defeat you. I exist for nothing else. It doesn't have to be that way. I am sorry. I have failed. A machine is worthless if it cannot fulfill its purpose. I'm sorry. Oh, that's it. That's I'm the story. Afraid. Hey, don't scare me like that. <clears throat> Is something wrong? Well, it's a full moon tonight. You noticed it too, didn't you, Senpai? Jeez, I'm starting to feel like a workaholic. Oh no, did something? We don't know anything for sure. However, we can't find Igis. Huh. Where would she have gone? I sensed a persona, but it quickly disappeared. And soon after that, I couldn't detect Igis's presence. Could it have been Strega? Well, she hasn't sensed any of their members, but we can't be positive. I've confirmed Igis's location. She's on the Moonlight Bridge. All right, call the others. Let's see what's going on there. I guess. I'm sorry. I... I remember everything, who I am, who he is. Damn it. I know why I wanted to be by your side. I'm sorry. I failed. What happened? There's no need for you to apologize. Huh? Who's that? Roji? It's going to be okay. I'm... Sorry. There's no... Save your energy. I'm... <clears throat> sorry. There's no need for you to apologize. Okay, I think I'm gonna close it here. It's gonna have a weird cliffhanger thing. 
And anyway, I think I get the gist of the story. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And see you again on the next episode. Have a nice day.